What's up guys, my name is Apprentai and welcome back to another episode of Test Tube Tuesday. You guys loved the first one I did last week, the first official one that I did last week and you said you want to see a lot more and you also suggested some improvements which I've taken on board as well. So, first off, I'm going to stick with some similar spirits, them being rum, gin, vodka and whiskey or bourbon. I'm going to stick with them each week, might change the product wise, so obviously this week it's Jack Daniels and Kraken instead of last week we used Bacardi and we used uh, Jim Beam. Um, these two are the same as last week, but we'll be swapping them out. So we'll stay this kind of four base spirits and an additional two. So the additional two this week is tequila and Aperol because what we have here is we have a Belvoir Raspberry Lemonade. So as always in here we have the Aperol and then we have the tequila, uh, Jack Daniels Honey, Zabrocca, uh, Gin and then Rum. That's the way it is. So let's just get pouring. I hope I have enough. Now I should have enough. These test tubes aren't that, that big. It's really nice. It's kind of really sweet. And then um, quite raspberry as well. Obviously it's a, a raspberry lemonade. But let's just pour this away in here. Something funny is happening with this one. The rum is being displaced. I don't know how this has happened. Because I suppose rum is really quite light. And all the sugars in this. So it's kind of like sunk to the bottom. And you can see like a darkness tinge where it starts to take a bit of the colour. But it's not mixed fully. Really. That's quite interesting because the rest have mixed. Um, so I'm going to start this end. We'll work my way across. I have water to cleanse my palate afterwards as well. We're going to get straight on with it with the Aperol one first. Disgusting. Absolutely vile. Not nice at all. Blah. Right, the one I'm dreading. Tequila. I expect this to be even worse than the Aperol, so here we go. <laughs> Blah. That was horrible. Absolutely vile. Jack Daniels Honey, again, don't expect this to be any good. Here we are. Okay. It's not bad, actually. It's not great, but it's not bad. I'd drink it if someone gave it to me. It's a broca. I had a surprise with this last week because I love this thing. And it shocked me because the combination was disgusting. So, can it redeem itself this week? Hmm. Yes, it can. That is an amazing flavour combination. Oh my god, wow. Beautiful flavours. It's not too sweet, it's not too heavy, it's nice and balanced, it doesn't bring a big burn to your, your throat. I like it. That is the best one so far. Right, the gin. The Ian Mill. This one should go well. I hope. Again, a good one. Good, not great, but not bad either, and not okay. There's nothing really to it. It just tastes like gin and raspberry lemonade. There's no like wowing factor or anything to it. And the last one, which is the cracking one, the rum. See what this tastes like. Uh, uh, that is not nice. It's not as bad as these two. It's just not leaving a nice aftertaste in there at all. Okay, there we go. This one was great. This was good. This was okay. This was bad. This was horrible. And this was disgusting. Like, yes, I drink it. Yes, I drink it. Yes, I would drink it. Probably drink it if someone gave it to me and I was really drunk. Probably would try to avoid it. I would not touch it. It's the order for today's Test Tube Tuesday.
That's it for another Test Tube Tuesday. I hope you guys have enjoyed it. If you have, a like rating would be wonderful. If you're new around here as well, please make sure you hit subscribe. If you have any product suggestions that you want me to use or to try out for Test Tube Tuesday, whether it be something like a grape soda or iron brew or anything along those lines, let me know in the comment section down below. If you have any suggestions as well on how we can improve the series, again, the comment section is where to pop that. If you want to check any of my social media out, Instagram, Snapchat, Twitter, Facebook, all that good stuff, links to them will be in the description. Other than that guys, until next time, I've been The Prentai, and I'll see you in the next one.